That's your girl Honcho VB back with another video. I don't know if you guys like steak and cheese subs as much as I do. Well, suppose you want to have a steak and cheese, but you don't want all the carbs. So why don't we do steak and cheese stuffed peppers? I'm going to use the uh, John Souls beef steak. And we got the provolone cheese. We're going to build it like we would a sub. I've got some mushrooms. I've cut up some onions. And then we got the green pepper. Okay, so now I'm going to um, I'm going to get the green peppers all washed up. And let's go and assemble this um, the stuffed peppers. Be right back. Okay, guys. Uh, I've never done this before. So I'll be experimenting. So basically I'm trying to put the things that I into these stuffed peppers that I would have on my sub. So I'm going to throw in my onions into this pan. This pan came with my air fryer and if I didn't mention we're going to put everything into the air fryer. And I'm going to throw in some mushrooms. I'm going to spritz it with uh, some coconut oil. You can season it with a little salt and pepper if you want. And I'm just going to put it in the air fryer for now just to soften up the veggies before I stuff them into the um, green pepper. I'm going to put them in the air fryer for about five minutes on 400. Be right back. Okay, so I got my um, green peppers cut in half and I cleaned them out. I have my provolone cheese and I just took the, um, the veggies out of the air fryer that I softened up. So that was five minutes at 400. So now I'm going to start putting the um, the ingredients into the green peppers. So provolone, stuff that in there. Now I'm going to take some of the softened veggies okay so now we want to get some of the steak on top and this uh, just came out the freezer so okay let's pop this into the uh, air fryer basket Okay, so I put some parchment paper into the air fryer basket. And I'm just going to put in the peppers. I really don't know what the time would be, so we're just trying this out. So for starters, I'm going to do 400 degrees at uh, for 10 minutes. And I'm going to check it at the end. At the end, I'm going to top it with some more provolone cherry, cheese. So... Let's get it over into the air fryer. Okay guys, this is what we're looking like after 10 minutes. It looks good. Oh yeah. I'm going to top it off with the um, cheese and then we're done. And it smells like a cheese steak. Okay, I guess back in the air fryer for about 2 minutes. Okay. I just took it out of the air fryer. I actually put it on 370 for 1 minute. To melt the cheese. I mean, we didn't need to keep it on for too long just to melt a little bit of cheese. Okay, let me plate this. Okay, guys, here we go. I think this looks pretty good. Steak and cheese. Steak and cheese stuffed peppers. Yum. I have mushrooms and onions in the, in the inside, and then we have the lettuce and tomato. So you assemble it, you'll have it just like your steak and cheese sub. Minus the bread. Okay, guys. Let's give this a taste. I had to let it cool off a bit. It was too hot. Mmm. 
Yummy. Hmm. Mm hmm. This is really good. Let me get another bite of this. Yes. Good. You know, if you don't want to put um, steak in your peppers, you can also, you can substitute um, chicken or whatever other meat you might want to put in there. I think this is a winner. I'm definitely going to do it again. And I hope you all like it too. Anyway, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up like share and subscribe so until next time hacho bb is out peace <laughs>